was uh, uh, was not uh, a Cranko or a Tilco, and uh, uh, he survived the storm, but he had some damage from, to some of his wire antennas. But you know, it's uh, it was pretty minimal here in this area. So uh, WB4 IUI, WB5 IRI. A uh, WB5 IRI from WB4 IUI. Hey Doug, how far are you from Beaumont? Are you near the Beaumont area? I've got a friend I've known for probably 30 years or more. WB5 ITT Chris lives out somewhere around the Beaumont area. He had mentioned uh, uh, yesterday. I hadn't heard from him since the storm came in, so I don't know. I don't know how that is in respect to the storm over. The town you were asking me uh, how far I am. Uh, I'm about 80 miles from Houston, uh, halfway between Houston and Austin, Texas, to the to the northwest of Houston, about 80 miles. And so, uh, you know, that's where we're located. A little town of Industry, Texas, out in the middle of nowhere. Over. No, oh, okay, okay, very good on Industry, Texas. Yeah, your signal here is holding about an S9. There's a little QSB, but otherwise, you're doing a great job. Um, yeah, I've got a friend, WB5ITT, he lives around Beaumont. He lives in the Beaumont area. I haven't heard from him since the storm came in, so I don't know I don't know how that is or where that's at in respect to uh, your location. And, and you probably told me, but I forgot, how much uh, power, what kind of rig are you running over? Yeah, Beaumont is uh, on the east side of Texas, so southeast, and so... Uh, they got uh, they got a lot of water. They were on the dirty side of the storm. Uh, it, was a, it was a Cat 1 hurricane, so I don't know what kind of winds they had there in Beaumont. Probably, uh, you know, 80 to 90 miles an hour. And then uh, maybe uh, as much as 10 to 12 inches of rain. I really, really don't know, uh, you know, exactly what the conditions are in Beaumont. But power is out for uh, about 3 million people in that area. And so, you know... Nobody's got any electricity because all the trees came down and all our power lines are, are uh, above ground and the tree limbs, of course, knocked them down. So, uh, you know, they're, they're suffering. Uh, all those people sweltering in the heat. We never even lost power here, thank goodness. And, and so I'm, I'm sitting here comfortable in the air conditioning. The rig, by the way, is the IC7610. And uh, I am driving a Mercury Lux amplifier right at uh, a kilowatt uh, peak. Uh, 270 watts a carrier, and uh, you know, at then as I said, the three element step IR at uh, 70 feet. And I got you at uh, like 56 degrees, uh, pointed up in your direction. That should be close to you, should be right on you. Three watts, I mean, you know, you're S5, it's amazing. <laughs> it's amazing, of course, you know, with your antenna way on up there in the sky, that, that makes a big difference, too. Over.